<laughs> not married. Uh, we have a memory foam mattress at home. That's what we sleep on. A memory foam mattress. That mattress is made for sleeping and sleeping only. That is, uh, that is the only thing that should be done on that mattress because that's what it was designed for. That's why scientists came together to make it. It's made for resting comfortably and that's it. <laughs> Nothing else. You can try, but it's not gonna work. <laughs> I know, because I've tried, it's terrible. It's like trying to have sex in quicksand, it's the worst. <laughs> you get one and you both just start sinking in slowly. <laughs> Don't panic, baby, it makes it worse, just stay calm. Just try to get a leg out, try to get a leg out. <laughs> That's married life. <laughs> that memory foam mattress, that's an expensive mattress. That's a high dollar mattress. I don't make memory foam mattress money. I'm not in that range. This is how we got that mattress. My mother-in-law lives in Palm Springs and an old guy died. And we got his memory foam mattress. That's how that worked out. It was the circle of life on mattresses. <laughs> he never got to sleep in it, by the way. I don't have some creepy haunted mattress at home. He never got to sleep in it. He bought it brand new, never got to open it, and passed away, so it's not weird. <laughs> <laughs> but it does make me feel bad for that guy, because that meant he died in some uncomfortable mattress, <laughs> probably having to stare at the world's most comfortable mattress, like in the corner, just like, I should really call my grandson over to help me. Oh. <laughs> and now we make weird love on it. And that's how that works.